Add a point cloud in the project navigator. Click on the Get Started button. Now create a new folder or open a pre-existing one in the USBIM Cloud session. Choose the Upload Fail option. Or simply drag your point cloud fail into your cloud workspace. View your point cloud fail in 3D. With the selection box, identify which part of the point cloud you want to import into Edificious. This allows you to work only on the portion of the point cloud that you need to generate your BIM model. Click on Download to import the point cloud selection into Edificious. If necessary, import multiple different parts of your point cloud. Use the object grip to align the point cloud along the X or Y axis. Add a vertical section plane. Change the section plane color. Enable Disable the Point Cloud and Section Plane Viewing options. Activate the HRS Manager to quickly define the levels. Move and align the Point Cloud Object Grip to the Zero Level Reference. Now align the point cloud zero level reference to the corresponding HRS zero level reference. From the foundation level now add the underlying sublevels below the zero level reference. Align the level elevation height taking advantage of the point cloud snap nodes. Repeat the same procedure for further sublevels if present. From the roof level, add any extra levels that may be present above. Align the level elevation height taking advantage of the point cloud snap nodes. Repeat the same procedure for further upper levels if present. Add a horizontal section and position it at the desired level. Now open the level where you previously inserted the section and start modeling your architectural objects, such as, for example, the building envelope. Take advantage of your point cloud accelerators. Select the object start and end point. Change the alignment axis. Edit the length across both directions. Visually identify the thickness. If necessary fix the alignment angle. View the detected thickness, rounded and already used in your project values. Choose the correct thickness value and confirm data input. 
repeat the same operation for all other objects. In case of variable thicknesses, choose the variable thickness option. Visually identify both thicknesses and confirm values. Insert openings taking advantage of the point cloud accelerator tools. Let's see an example for a door. Specify the door start and end point. You have a dedicated viewing window. With part of your point cloud and the overlaid architectural model, you can visually identify the opening dimensions. View measured, rounded and last used values. Confirm the desired values. Choose the opening direction. Finally, confirm your data input. And now let's see an example for a window. Specify the window start and end point. Again, in the dedicated viewing window, with part of your point cloud and the overlaid architectural model. Visually identify the opening dimensions. View measured, rounded and last used values. Confirm the desired values. View the 3D model. Activate deactivate the point cloud and its sections. Use the functions in Edificious to work faster. For example, associate characteristics from one fixture to another. Or perfectly align the openings. Vertically. Or horizontally. You can easily complete your architectural model and view it with textures and shading. Also produce project drawings, such as a floor plan or any document you need for your project.